Hello friends, welcome back to another video. I am going to be reviewing Alpha Elite today and I did stumble across Alpha Elite over Black Friday. Once I got to the site, it was already pretty much completely picked over. There was only two items left that were a full set and I wanted to be able to review a complete set for this video. So I picked up the Revival Leggings and the Revival Bra, both in the color Deep Black and that's what I'm going to be reviewing today. So it's gonna be a short and sweet video, but we'll see if this revival set is worth the money. Okay, so before I dig into this, I wanted to talk a little bit about the packaging. So this is what it came in, these kind of little plastic bags. It has their logo, or their company name on it. It's got a little saying on the back, an athlete is an individual who inspires others to dream more, learn more, and be more. So this is cute, this is very nice. Um, they even put a little keychain in it with their logo on it, which is a nice little touch, you know, if you're not expecting something that's always cute. I'm seeing more and more companies use these kind of bags and individually wrap their clothing. Honestly, in my opinion, I kind of wish they wouldn't do that. It's a little bit wasteful to me. And although it looks very nice, when you're selling thousands and thousands of products, hundreds of thousands of products, it just, it can really take a toll on the environment, I have to say it. So I picked this set up for $48.60 was the price of the leggings and $34.20 was the price of the bra. So I got it for $82.80 with shipping, it ended up being $88.80. On their website, they have the leggings listed for 54 and the bra listed for 38 So that comes to a total of 92 I believe. Yeah, 92 So you're looking at $100 for a set, for a sports bra legging set. I don't tend to wear sports bras as my top, but you could. And if you do, you're looking at $100 for the set. In my opinion, $100 for a set is a little on the high side, so I definitely am going to have high expectations going into this review. So let's go ahead and get started. I'm gonna start with a sports bra. So like I said, Revival Sports Bra in deep black. It has the cute little crisscross pattern in the back. As soon as I pulled this out of the package, my immediate thought was, why are there no cups in it? So there are no insert bra cups into it. They do have a place where you can put your own in, which is good. I feel like everyone tends to have extra ones floating around. I personally like cups and I'm a little surprised that it didn't come with it, but not a huge deal. I can insert my own, it's just, it's a little annoying if you don't have extra ones to have to take it out of a different sports bra and put it into this one, so my feedback, add cups, add cups for the little girls. <laughs> Alright, so everybody understand? Yeah, I get it. Okay. Okay, so moving on, I'm going to be honest, it's not a very supportive sports bra. It's very stretchy, which is good. It makes it very comfortable, but it's not going to be a good sports bra for high intensity workouts. I won't be running in this. I won't be jumping around in this. This will just be for lifting, which is fine because I do a lot of just going to the gym and just lifting, um, so totally fine. But. I'm just, I wasn't wowed by this sports bra. There's nothing that makes me feel like, oh my God, it's so adorable, I have to keep it. I don't know, I would say I'd give it like a five out of 10 probably, if I'm rating it. <laughs> and I am. The material does feel nice, even though it is very stretchy. It feels like it's a durable material. It's, uh, I believe it was elastane and polyurethane. Um, I'll put it on the screen if that's incorrect. But so it does feel very durable. It feels like I could wash this a lot and get a lot of use out of it and it would hold up well. But just because it is a very stretchy sports bra and it's not like the most flattering, like it's not super adorable, I just wasn't really wowed by it. Okay, moving on to the leggings. So the Revival leggings, as soon as I pulled them out of the package and started putting them on, I was immediately in love with them. Like literally was thinking, these are some of the best leggings I've put on in a really long time. They've got the little Alpha Elite logo, company name, <laughs> on the waistband. And the material just feels so nice. It feels very compressive. I'm like looking in the mirror and I can just tell it's becoming best friends with the booty right off the bat, loving how it's looking, loving how it's sitting on the waist, it's not digging in, it looks really nice. And then I did the try-on video. And that's where stuff starts to get funny. <laughs> 
So I did the try on video and I'm watching it back and I was like, holy guacamole. These are so see-through and I'm really surprised for 55, did I say $55? I think they're 55. For $55 leggings, I would not expect them to be see-through, especially in black. And so I take them back to the bedroom just to see if, well, maybe it's just because I'm in front of really natural lighting, maybe that's why. And it was a little bit better in my bedroom. So if you're in the gym, it's probably not gonna be super noticeable, but then I noticed something else that I was like, oh no. <sighs> This like oval section right here, can you see that? It is like 10 times more see-through than the bum area. So that to me is a hard no. I think I would be so self-conscious, especially in that area. Like you don't wanna be doing hip thrusts or like RDLs or anything. So I had to get creative and try and think of how I could show you this. So for me, that was a no-go on these, unfortunately. I was so loving the material and was really bummed when I saw that, but hopefully um, that gets fixed in the future because, like I said, I was really loving this material and had high hopes for it. I hate to not have at least one thing I was really happy with and that I could uh, recommend, but unfortunately I was limited in the beginning of what I could purchase from them and then they just neither of them worked out. So that's going to conclude this video. I'm slightly bummed but I'm holding out hope in the future. I'll give some other items a try. If you've tried anything out, let me know in the comments from their line and you really liked it so that I can try it. Whenever it comes back in stocks, I think everything is still like sold out on their site. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Give me a like, subscribe, all that good stuff. See you next time.